Hello, I'm Biman B. Mandal. I'm a professor at the Department of Biosciences and Bioengineering, and I'm also affiliated to uh, School of Health Sciences and Technology and also the Center for Nanotechnology. Um, in this research, what we have done is we're trying to address a very uh, potent problem of uh, meniscus repair and regeneration. And generally, meniscus uh, is a soft tissue, a cushion like structure, which uh, protects the body from shocks. And uh, with time, with age, what happens is this meniscus either herniates or there is a, a need for a repair uh, because it is a tearing that happens. And with age particularly, this is a bit, you know, potent problem uh, leading to osteoarthritis. There has been uh, technically some solutions to this uh, which researchers have come out either to regenerate and repair. As a gold standard, uh, surgeons try to stitch it together if it is repairable, uh, but in many cases it is not repairable and there comes our research where uh, what we have developed is a, a, a formulation which is based on silk based biopolymer and some other additives that we have used as components which help in regenerate this meniscus and also to repair it. Uh, how it works is uh, there are three components or three technologies I would say which are published in this uh, three journals uh, which is advanced biology and uh, applied materials today, uh, two of the other papers. Uh, in one we have developed this injectable gel which is technically taking care of any kind of uh, meniscus tear where through a minimally invasive way this can be injected at the site of repair and without need for a surgery this would aid in healing the meniscus leading to a active life. Uh, the other two where we have uh, again looked into how we can uh, 3D print or create this 3D dimension of the meniscus through, through the use of 3D bioprinting and uh, we have used a, a high-end 3D bioprinter here and we have created this bio ink which is the ink which is carrying the cells and the component which is in this case a cocktail of growth factors which we have derived from either synthetic or a natural component which is extracted from the blood, patient's own blood. So it is very uh, compatible uh, and it is very effective and overall the whole technology is very affordable and that's the underlying goal that how we can create looking at um, you know uh, addressing the common man's problem through a technology which is which can reach to the masses.